In this video, I'm going to show you how you can add your name, address, and payment details to the Microsoft Edge web browser so it automatically fills in those details every time you buy a product from a website and so on. So let's open up the Edge web browser. Normally this can be found either on your desktop, such as here, or you might find it also in the bottom taskbar. You can also use the search box here, just type in Microsoft Edge, or you can click on the Windows icon and go down to the letter M and under M you should see Microsoft Edge. So let's open up the web browser. So once it opens up, what you want to do is go to the top right hand corner and click on the three dots. And then from the menu, go down to settings. And the first option which appears on the left hand side is profiles. And from the sub menu, you can see we have the payment info and addresses and more. So if you want to add a credit card or a debit card, click on the payment information then click on add card, just enter your card number, your name, and the expiration date and so on. Make sure you click save. Once it's saved, it will be saved in that location. As for the address, it's the same kind of um, setup. Click on addresses and more. Click add address. You can then add your name, organization if you want to, phone number, email, your country, street address, post town, and postal code. Again, make sure you click on save when that is done. So I'm gonna enter those details now. Okay, I've now entered um, some fake details such as a fake name, address and so on for this demonstration. Once that is done, click the save button. As I said, if you do need to change any details, just you can see that the name is here. Just click on the three little dots again and you can select edit and you can edit the details or you can delete it if you want to. So once that's done, let's say for example, I go to a web page and I'm buying a product just as so. All I have to do now is put the mouse cursor over the first box, just click and the details will come up here. So you can see Joe Blogs, have a click on that. All the information will then be filled in automatically. You may find there are one or two boxes which don't fill out, such as the county and state, but most of them will fill out. So basically it's as simple as that. Thanks for watching.